Okay. Then the next function, this is a pretty interesting function. Okay. You will find that sometimes we have to, uh, we are interested in finding what is the length of the string. Okay. So length of the string, it gives this len function. Okay. Len function, it will get return the number of characters in the string, which is nothing but the length of the string. So the syntax is len and it will take only one argument. So what we can do is we can write len and we will write a4. So it will give you the answer. So what we have is, okay. so we will say len and I am doing good. If you see it has 20 characters. Okay. So, so then this you find the length of the string. So etc. you can create. Right. So what happens is it gives you the total. So here if you see there are lots of spaces. Okay, so if I remove the spaces, okay, so it it has become lower. So even so, what they are saying is even the spaces they count as the character. So make sure that when you are counting, okay, if your intention is not to include the space, remove the space and then count the string length. Or what you can do is you can trim first. So as an example over here, okay, what we can do is, okay, please note that we can do the nested function. So I, what I, want, I, I am doing is I will use trim first. Okay, I will use trim to remove the spaces and then I will use the len to get it. So what we can do is okay, we can use the trim function. Okay, right. So trim will make this. So this is what has trim has created. And then I can compute the len. Okay, so if I compute the len, so if you see it's only 15. Okay, and here we have. Uh, got 20 because the space have been counted. Now if you I wanted you to compute rather than doing two step I want you to do in the one step only. So what we have is we have to use a nested functions. Okay, So what are the nested function? What you will do is you are doing len. Okay, so here if you see you have computed the len. Okay, And in the len you have used this as a text. Okay, And how you got this? You got this by using the trim and the un text. Right? So what we can do is see this len is using this item which is this. So you can bring this over here and you can say that okay, len trim text. Okay? Now this is what we call as your nested function. Function inside the function and these are your very handy tools. So let us see over here if I want to remove the spaces count the string by not considering the spaces how many uh, how much length it would be so let us see what i will do is let's say remove this okay what we will do is we will compute the length okay but inside that we will compute the trim okay and we will do this okay right so if you see this is given so if you see the formula what we have is len trim and a4 so this is your nested function example